Hey Water Science and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your uh, daily love read for Monday the 21st of January 2019. This will be the energy of the eclipse uh, and full moon that we are having. A lot of intense energies uh, with these things going on. Uh, a lot of people are all in or all out. So just be cautious and beware of those energies that will be around us. So, Spirit Angels, what messages do you have for our water signs, the moon rising, and Venus for the 21st of January 2019? Please, all messages we brought for water signs, best and greatest good. Thank you. All right, your guys' first card out is the Seven of Cups. Your next card out is the Death in Reverse. And the Ace of Pentacles. The person you are dealing with. Who are water signs dealing with? Well, there's a new beginning here. The person you are dealing with, possible Sagittarius, but um, somebody who's been very impatient waiting for you to get over this confusion. Uh, the Nine of Swords in reverse. And the Five of Wands in reverse. Your guys' outcome. Oh. Your guys' outcome is the Four of Pentacles, the Two of Wands in reverse, and the Six of Cups in reverse. Your guys' bottom of the deck and shared energy with your person is the Queen of Cups. Clarified by the Page of Pentacles. And the Five of Swords in reverse. Your guys' bottom of the deck and overall energy is the Knight of Wands in reverse. Your next card out is the Four of Wands, however. All right. Let's see what we got here. We'll tip you on down. Okay. So we will start with your shared energy. So there is a lot of love and compassion for this person, whether it be to you or you to them or both. Um, there is unconditional love here. Uh, they have been very patiently waiting uh, for you to come forward and, uh, and offer them uh, a new beginning. They've been patiently waiting, or this is you, water sign. Um, you could be patiently waiting on an earth sign to make you an offer to come forward and give you any sort of news. Um, you guys could have walked away from this person or this person walked away from you in the past due to um, conflicts, due to financial issues, due to other people being in the um, equation. There's all sorts of situations I am seeing, but the shared emotion of the two of you is unconditional love. You have been very patient water signs waiting for this offer to come back. Even though the longer that it has is taking them, the more confused you have become. You thought you would have been in a relationship by now. Um, you have a lot of options. There's people always wanting to um, entertain you, uh, wanting to have your attention. There's also people that could be intentionally... Um, putting things um, or telling you things to try to uh, confuse you, trying to keep you waiting, trying to keep you from moving forward with this death process because they want to offer you this Ace of Pentacles. They just couldn't quite um, at the time. So they would tell you things or not tell you things to intentionally keep you confused, to keep you from purging them out of your, out of your life to keep you from um, going through this death process, to ascending to a, a different level of uh, awareness and move on without them. They were scared that you were moving forward um, without them while and no longer worrying, worrying about this offer. 
they do want to offer you this new beginning. However, you will get this new beginning, water signs, whether you wait for them or not. Um, it's time to no longer uh, refuse this uh, death process here. Um, it's it's the natural law of life is is it's equal is death. So um, it's something that we all go through. It's something that we all have to deal with. Um, so don't fear it. Don't be confused by it. Allow this to happen and allow yourself to, um, seam seamlessly go from an ending to a new beginning as you go through this, uh, death and rebirth process. And once you come out of that rebirth process, you have a brand new world waiting for you, um, and gifts of abundance, um, to follow as well. This is the universe giving you your second chance here during this eclipse energy. So don't fight what the universe is trying to take out of your life because it's meant to go. If it goes during the eclipse, it is meant to go during the, you know, the couple days before and after the person you are dealing with, they, um, they have been trying to, uh, Yeah, they, well, I, I'm seeing both stories. I'm seeing both storylines here because, um, the first, everything I said for you, water signs, I do see this for your partner as well. For some of you, you are the ones that are not, uh, you are the ones that were keeping this person confused intentionally to keep them, uh, waiting, uh, because you were scared to go through this rebirth process. Um, but so I'm going to do both storylines here. For those of you who were confused by a by somebody else um, intentionally, uh, so you would wait. This person um, was having a hard time uh, following their inner voice, finding a hard time finding the self esteem, finding their value. Um, they really have a low self esteem, so they allowed their uh, their anxieties, their stress, their thoughts to get in the way of their forward progress really causing a lot of inner conflict with this eclipse energy. This is all coming to an end. They are going to find the steps forward to get out of this place of being stuck. For those of you water signs who put this person in that stuck place, uh, they are growing impatient, waiting on you to come forward. They spent a lot of nights worrying and stressing about this connection. And if it was coming back into a relationship, they have healed to the point where they no longer care about this connection not coming back into fruition. Before they lived and died by, it had to happen. I had to have this relationship. They know now that they're going to get this new beginning with or without you. So they're letting it go. They're letting it to God. And that's nothing against you. I'm just saying they are finally releasing the outcome of this relationship, knowing and having the faith that this relationship will come back to them when they do that. They're no longer having that inner conflict. Um, they're no longer, uh, um, this person could be dating other people now waiting for you, um, because they weren't putting their life on hold anymore for you water signs. Now that's if you put somebody in wait, the first, uh, situation was if they put you in wait, the, uh, final outcome for either side here is the four of pentacles, the two of wands in reverse and the six of cups in reverse. So we got the four of pentacles, not uh, wanting to share our emotions, being closed off, having a wall up. Um, some of you could be hiding money. Um, but for a lot of you, you are dealing with a Sagittarius. We got temperance and the knight of wands, but you're not opening up to this uh, fire sign or this earth sign, guys. Uh, you're you're uh, holding back for some reason. This person's raring and ready to go. I do see, however, this your wall is going to come down in this uh, energy that we are uh, dealing with. But um, you're going to let your passion, you're going to let your passion in and it is going to move forward. But um, you're going to have to let them in emotionally. You have been blocking them out and not allowing them to uh, know exactly how you feel. That's got to come to an end if you want this to move forward. All right. Oh my goodness, guys. My cards are just flying. All right. Why is the two of wands in reverse here for our water signs? These are future predictor predictions. 
with the after tarot. These are the cards that come after your regular Raider weight. All right, look at that. We got the Two of Wands in reverse, clarified by the Two of Wands in the upright. You're no longer confused on who you want to untie from. Person, place, thing, emotion, situation. You are um, more confident than ever who you want to invest and who you want to walk down a path with. You are picking the person that is your soulmate, as this being the bottom of the deck. This is somebody you are going to share the rest of your life with. If you are not in the Twin Flame journey, you are finding a life partner and you choose your life partner. If you are um, with a soulmate, you are choosing to turn in your soul contract and be in this soulmate relationship, which once again is a life partner. Oh, all right. Beautiful. But you have to go through this spiritual rebirth first, and then you will come out awakened and you will know exactly what path you want to take and who you want to take it with. Beautiful energy there. It'll be very passionate, very very love. Oh, just full of love. All right. Why is the six of cups here in reverse for our water signs? Yeah. But first you have to allow the tower to come down in a situation with somebody that you've been with, um, for quite some time. Um, this is somebody possibly you have children with, um, this is somebody from your past. You have to untie from them before you can go down this path and you have to let the tower fall um, before uh, you can move forward. Yes, and there's temperance again. It did come out in the reverse. I don't read the after tarot in reverse, but it, I do acknowledge it when it comes out in reverse because uh, it did for a reason. But when you allow this tower to fall, water signs, when you let go of this person that you either have children with or that you have been with for a long period of time, when you let go of that, that has already ran, the emotions have already run dry in this situation. There's a lot of fighting. Um, you could have had a short separation for a while. When you let go of that, when you let the tower fall, you have a twin flame soulmate life partner, um, love coming in. This is going to bring you balance, peace, hope in the future, and much, much abundance and happiness. Wow. Balance and you will be able to end this major life cycle starting anew with the person you are meant to spend your life with. You will end up picking the right path, water signs. So follow your heart. Allow this death and rebirth process to um, happen. And then you can move very quickly into this twin flame soulmate life partner connection. All right, Water Science, have a beautiful and blessed day. I send you lots of healing, love, and light. God bless.